On the birth of your child, a demon appears and says, your child will be extraordinarily attractive, you shall receive one billion dollars, if they are a virgin at age 25, otherwise your soul and this will be mine. You cannot inform your child of any aspect of the deal. What is your plan? That is literally the basis for every fairy tale. Why do you think the princess is trapped in the high tower, guarded by dragons or babysat by little people? Wake up people it was the one dollar billion. And oh yeah that will be my answer. I will lock the kid in a high tower, except I'll get better dragons. This is gonna be a hell of a way, to discover your child is really into dragons. Bad dragons specifically. Uh oh. Build an underground bunker stocked with necessities for 25 years, and convince my child that we are living in a post-apocalyptic hellscape. It would probably be so mentally scarring when we got the money and I revealed it was a ploy that our lives would be even more ruined and we'd never recover. Damn. This demon is a stone-cold bastard. Paul Twist. The actual apocalypse happens 24 years and 364 days in. You have no idea due to the isolation. You walk out of the bunker on the kid's 25th birthday a billionaire and die of radiation exposure. Alternatively, due to runaway inflation, one billion dollars is now the approximate price of a cold beer. Get them a World of Warcraft subscription. The cosplay scene at conventions is a raging fury of hormones. Your soul is doomed. Destroy the child. The body shall age. Thinking outside the box so no one gets inside the box. I like it. Rapunzel that kid. Rapunzel birth twins at age 14. Yeah fed. As someone who was home showed until high school. Homeschool them all the way through high school. Took me years to be able to figure out how to talk to people. And my social skills are still whack. I probably would never have figured out how to get laid if the homeschooling had gone through high school. If it makes you feel better, I went to school all the way through, and I still, have no social skills. Same. Never been home shawled, and I'm still awkward as hell and suck at socializing at 22. I won't tell them about the deal. I will tell them I will give them 100 million dollars, if they are a virgin at 25. I would also introduce them to Reddit, since everyone here is a virgin. I would also try to get them into MMOs. I would also try to make them paranoid about STDs. Since I don't like the soul stealing part, I wouldn't let them get a driver's license, and I would move to the middle of nowhere and not let them communicate with people I roll that I don't approve of first. Also, I hope my parents took this deal. If you want to make them paranoid about STDs, look in a good nursing textbook. The pictures are gory. I remember being shown them in middle school, abstinence only education state. I was totally freaked out b slash c there were uncircumcised penis, and I thought the foreskin was part of the disease. I now know demons are real, and have tons of money, semicolon, new career, demon hunter. Let's team up, I'm sure we'd make a great team, I'll start sniffing for leads. Do you have a Chevy Impala? I would lie to my child claiming that an angel made a deal with me for half a billion if they are a virgin at 30. I haven't told them about the real deal, so I haven't broken any rules. Once the kid hits 25 I collect the billion and give them half and a bunch of condoms and tell them to go get some. This is clever. I like it. Demons and genies are always twisting the meaning of words and splitting hairs or using technicalities to make things hard for humans, so I wanted to get a little payback. Say no. No. Thank you. Let's show some manners when dealing with a demon. No please. Make it 500 million and 12 and a half. And you're on. Hull up. A chastity belt. It's an everlast. Didn't expect to see a men in tights reference today. Keep them in basement. Give them nothing but art supplies. A waste chute slash bathroom. A water source. And a food source. Sell the paintings and live comfortably. Jimpakins? Is that you? If he's anything like me, he'll easily make it to 25 as a virgin bee. But he's not anything like you. He's extraordinarily attractive. Please apply water to the burnt area. Move to a secluded area. Become disgustingly religious. Cry every night for 25 years. Collect 1 billion dollars. 
No better way to make sure your child will be a tremendous slut than by bringing them up in a strict religious household. It's perfectly fine if they are a slut after 25, though. Yeah, but they won't hold out that long. Sticks and stones might break some bones, but zip ties and chains restrict them. Don't raise them at all, so they don't develop any social skills. Throw in braces, and a terrible haircut for extra protection. Then, use some of that billion dollars, to rehabilitate them, after they are 25. This might work for a son, but will just make a daughter look like an easy target to some boys. Also, this is a demon pact, likely magical in essence, with great desire in them, and those that they meet. Will this billion be adjusted for inflation? Someone is finally asking the right question. Offer them one million dollars, if they fill the Pokemon Go Pokedex. You really chose the only game that makes them actually get out of their basement? Well, he can take his billion, and go fuck himself with it. I'm getting my kid into modeling and social media, then I'll help them start clothing and perfume lines. Imma go full Kardashian, and get that billion a lot sooner. This is the right answer, soul man. Kardashians don't have souls anyway. Introduce him to Reddit. Now send him over to the brain soul forum, he'll never get laid, though it would be a sad path, to see him go down, and a tough one to break. I think the easiest thing here is tell your kid, that both of you, and the kid are carriers of a rare disease that is lethal, and that basically, if they have sex with someone there is a fairly high chance it could kill that person in an excruciating manner, you are going to get a billion dollars out of this oh, so you could even spend a couple hundred or thousand dollars, to create fake advocacy websites for this disease, and pay some people on Fiverr to make YouTube videos about them also having the disease, and how it really did kill people they had sex with, then like. Make sure you tell your kid that the disease is only transmitted through sexual intercourse and they can still hook up with people in other ways without killing them. That way they don't have to go through life without any kind of gratification. I feel like this would work when you get the money from the demon. Just fake it like you won the lottery and pretend to use some of the money to invest in some kind of miracle cure experimental pill that is actually a placebo. Tell your kid they are cured and that should fix everything and basically hope they never learn how to do proper internet searches themselves, or speak to a doctor on their own. Just be a normal Asian parent. Continually undermine their self-esteem, until they have no sense of self-worth, and they dedicate their lives to getting good grades, and making you proud. As a nation my reaction to this post is like, wait you guys are getting paid. Don't invite Uncle Dan over for one. As long as he doesn't go all the way, Dan could mentally make them terrified of sexual contact long past the age of 25. Keep him slash her at home until he slash she is 25. And make sure not to break their arms. Teach them to play Dungeons and Dragons. I should be offended by this, but luckily Vicious Mockery only does 1d4 damage, and while I have disadvantage on my attack roll I can simply use a spell, that instead requires a save such as Toll the Dead which should deal 1d12 necrotic in the event that stubbed your toe recently. Yeah you aren't fully wrong there. Don't have sex until you're 26, and I'll give you 100 million dollars. I'll know if you did. Technically not informing them. Flex tape. This explains Mormonism better than any other leading theory. Homeschool backslash backslash underscore slash. The old fashioned lock on all the doors and windows. A slit in the door for food. Impure as hell. It'll do anything. 